Lighting can be one of the biggest differences in your videos from being okay to doing great. In this video, I'm gonna show you a small LED light that comes in at $60 right now. Lumecube has been known for their namesake waterproof Bluetooth lights, but have recently expanded their lineup of lighting solutions with the Loom Cube Panel Mini, a deck of card size bicolor LED light aimed at content creators. Most creators will be familiar with Aperture, a lighting brand that has nailed it when it comes to reaching out and building a community. Their equipment is all but the standard for anyone serious about YouTube. The Panel Mini seems to fill a gap left in the popular Aperture lineup of portable lights around the $60 mark. The Loomcube Panel Mini offers something new and easy to use. Even advanced video creators may find a use for something this small and versatile. With 60 LED lights, the Panel Mini is bright. It's also accurate with a 96 plus color rendering index value. Half the lights are daylight balanced white while the others are tungsten. This means you can easily mix the two LEDs for color adjustability from 3200 Kelvin to 5600 Kelvin. The light offers a maximum of 550 lux of brightness at a half a meter's distance. That's a decent amount of light, but it means this is best for tabletop photography or close-up video work. But don't worry, the light looks great close up thanks to the included silicone diffuser that can easily slip on and off the light. And even without the diffuser, the light is pretty soft since there's a built-in diffusion panel. Right out of the box, I was impressed with this light. Its aluminum body gives a better feel than the Aperture ALM9's plastic construction. Now they both feature the same small design equal to about a deck of cards. However, the Panel Mini is just slightly longer. The only real size difference is noticeable when you attach the Panel Mini's silicon diffuser. This bulks the light up a bit, though it's really not that big of a deal. I feel the silicone diffuser might even protect the panel mini from being damaged if you bump it into something or drop it, like I've already done. The controls on the light are simple and elegant. With just one button and one rocker dial, the light can be operated single-handed, even without looking at it. But the intelligent LCD makes precise operation a breeze thanks to its simple controls. The handy LCD panel quickly shows your charge, time remaining, color temperature, and output level. The Panel Mini seems to do a good job of calculating the battery time depending on your output, which can drastically alter the battery life. At 100% power, I was able to get nearly an hour and a half of usage at both 3200 Kelvin and 5600 Kelvin color temperatures. At 50% power, you can add around another hour to that runtime for both 3200 and 5600 Kelvin. So let's see how you can use this little LED light. I'm gonna first set it up as a fill light. Now typically I shoot these videos with just one light and that's the Godox SL60W. What I'm gonna do now is set the Loom Cube Panel Mini up as a fill light just off camera. Now as you can see, the right side of my face is a little more illuminated and doesn't have that harsh shadow or fall off as my videos typically look. Now this isn't the look I usually want, but for those that do, this is a great little light to do this with. Now let's set this up as a backlight, meaning I'm literally gonna set it on the shelves behind me to add some fill light that gives me separation off of the background, which in turn will also provide the shot with a little more depth. Okay, so now my colored LEDs are off and I have the Loom Cube Panel Mini set up behind me on a shelf as a backlight. It gives the shot a bit of a different look and you should see the separation from me and the background as well as almost a glow around me just another simple but effective way you can use this light. Overall, this little light's form factor and ease of use is a huge plus for me and my on-the-go video kit. With more mounting options than the Aperture ALM9, a fairly quick charging time and decent battery life, which can be extended by plugging it into a USB power brick, this little light is a great addition to anyone's bag. To learn even more about social media marketing, video, and product reviews, make sure to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.